Have you got a pixie look? Or have you secretly wanted one and thought, hmm, I'm not sure what products to use or how to maintain this hair, even washing it at home? Well, if you stick around, I can show you how using these. Well, the first thing actually just about my experience of using Curapro products is when I first had my hair dyed blonde, I was absolutely oblivious to it all i did not know what to do with my hair my hair kept getting so dry and brittle it was shedding my husband was like jay you need to do something about your hair because it was just not doing well week three would come week four my hair was just all over the place it lost its structure and i was like help i need to sort out this hair so i got a guide from my stylists and they referred me to using care care that's exactly great for this blonde look. So the first product I actually use in my Kerico range is the moisturizing shampoo for color treated hair. And this product is amazing because what happens is, is that when you wash it, it really moisturizes the hair. It maintains the hair. It keeps the color also as well with this product. It actually helps to keep the tone because as you know, if you know about blonde hair, it, the tone fades out three, four weeks, the tone is gone and it goes a bit more brassy. Um, so that's really good, that product, because it really gives it the moisture. So it exactly does what it says on the bottle. Next product I use is a conditioning cream hairdress. This product actually, you don't need to use too much. So I find if I if you use too much, what will happen is that it will get over greased and with afro hair so i've got afro hair because i can't relax it because of having bleach in my hair all will happen is it will start to lift and then you'll have to wash it and it's like no we don't want to wash it so you just the thing is with blonde hair you know literally when to wash your hair because it will speak to you you need moisture moisture is the key for blonde hair but you don't need to put too much in it because obviously it will just it will, it will you just know anyway This one is the Silk and Seal. This is brilliant. This is good for if you're blow drying hair and it really helps it to be silky and smooth and you don't need to use too much. It's a quite an expensive bo little bottle, but you don't need to use too much because it gets quite sticky, it's oil. So um, use it sparingly and distribute it well to your hair just before you blow dry it. This is my latest purchase actually, this is Care Care and it's an oil sheen with humidity block. With this, I use this every day on my hair, but I realise I don't, you don't need to use too much, you just spray it lightly on your hair because again, what I said with the other product, you don't, you don't want to make it too greasy your hair because what will happen again, you're going to have to wash it and to be honest, I wash my hair, I try to wash my hair like every two weeks. Well, this is my deep moisturizing mask. Well, this is my favorite product. I love this one. Oh my goodness, the first time I used this one, I just kept distributing loads on my hair. But for you guys, you don't need to use too much. Leave this for like on for like 15 to 30 minutes. Grab your cup of coffee or whatever drink you desire and just relax. Oh, and also don't, don't forget your processing cap. You pop that on and you just chill for like up to 30 minutes. And this baby here, oh my goodness, it really helps to put that moisture in your hair, especially blonde hair, it gets very, very dry. So you need to make sure that you use this. I use this every two weeks when I wash my hair, just so it gives a hydration, hydrates the hair, and it feeds the hair because the hair needs a drink once in a while. So this is very good. I would definitely highly recommend this mask. Um, and I've been using it for the last, maybe two, three months now my hair. So that is it. All the things I use for, to maintain my blonde pixie look. So that wasn't hard, was it? I mean, I stumbled at the beginning of my hair. As I said to you before, it was dry, it was shedding. It was almost like it's gonna fall out, but thank God my hair's thick. 
but I actually eventually found out these products and I'm so glad that I've had to share, I've got to share it with you today. If anyone has used KeraCare products, let me know about your experiences below. Also, let me know in the comments below if there's any products that's your favorite out of all the, out of these products or whether if there's any other products that I've missed out that I've not shared with you today. And we can have a conversation below. We can talk about different hairstyles and you know, we can give each other updates. So it'd be great to just have a great conversation about how to maintain our hair. Because listen, we want to have boss hair. We want to make, be able to use the right products and to be able to not just use the right product, but use the right products for our hair type, I think, which is important as well. We can also encourage each other and help each other out, especially when you're thinking, oh, bad hair day. But we don't want no more of those because I don't like those at all. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love these products. So I'm going to pop it in the link below and you can find out how to get those products to you. Thank you so much for watching comment below and let me know how you all got on with all the hair products i talked about earlier and hopefully hair didn't fall out <laughs> but we can have fun on here and for more videos from me and it's the Aries of Sullers, like comment and subscribe oh and don't forget to press that subscribe button and the notification bell for more videos thank you bye Thanks for watching, it's the Aeris Asulas. We've had a lot of fun making the program. We had a lot of fun doing this channel. If you like what you see, you know what? Be part of our extended family, our tribe, so to speak. Be in the bell, and we'll see you real soon. Take care.